today we're at Port McKenzie. This will be the first time we've had an international shipment of scrap metal. The scrap metal is being loaded today on a ship flagged out of Singapore. Uh, we expect the vessel will be finished loading by about Wednesday, whereupon it will embark upon an eight-day voyage to South Korea. The buyers of the scrap metal wanted to see confirmation that Port McKenzie was capable of exporting the scrap metal. So really this is a test shipment. What we anticipate in the future is larger volume uh, moving at a quicker rate. There's the real potential that we could see some improvements down here on the water side of Port McKenzie to facilitate quicker transfer of the scrap metal from the shore side onto the vessel. The ice is a lot heavier than it normally is this time of year, but the ice has presented absolutely no challenge either for the vessel, the tug, or any of the crew. From what we've seen since 2004, the, the ice at Cook Inlet presents some challenges to the efficiency of Port McKenzie, but absolutely no challenge to the operation of the port. The, the peoples came by yesterday from overseas. They are very happy and they see like a, some new venture start from Alaska and they have a very high hopes they can do direct business with Alaska in the future. If you're taking something to like a Seattle, Seattle to all the way to Korea is like about 21 days. But from Alaska to Korea, is, if the weather is nice, is 11 days, or max is 14 days. So they are more interested to be do business over here than Seattle. We are proving to Alaska, and we're proving to international market, yes, Alaska have a potential, let's come invest money and like start create jobs and do something over here.